Okay, we are already back on the topic of Roblox Jenna, despite only four days passing since the last time I talked about this, because four days ago I uploaded a video called Scary Roblox Warning About Hackers, brackets, TikTok. Now obviously we can always count on the Roblox community side of TikTok to bring us the most laughable, the worst rumours that we have ever seen on Roblox. But the reason I want to talk about this once again is mainly because yesterday and the day before was supposed to be the days that Jenna would supposedly hack every single girl player on the entire platform of Roblox. But before we get into all of that good stuff, I would first like to say please leave a like on this video and subscribe. Obviously, with it now being the 9th of February and the rumour saying that Jenna would come to Roblox and hack everyone on the 7th and the 8th, surely that means that Jenna has now made her way onto Roblox and it has started the process or maybe even finished the process of hacking every single girl player on the entire platform of Roblox. And I mean just to make this as crystal clear as I possibly can, this is nothing more than rumours, this is 100% fake, there is no big scary Roblox hacker known as Jenna. Jenna is basically I guess the new generation John Doe. She's nothing more than a myth, a fake character that somebody created for an online data movie that people for some reason started spreading around that Jenna is actually a big scary hacker that will come to Roblox and hack everyone on the 7th and 8th of February. I mean if you missed everything about that I made an entire video explaining everything about this and why it's fake in my last video about this so I suggest you go ahead and watch this but in this video I just want to show some new things that I found about this because when the 7th of February actually rolled around Jenna is now trending on Twitter. This is related to Jenna the Roblox hacker who is fake and like it's not even Roblox Jenna or anything like that, literally just nothing more than the one word Jenna, the name Jenna was trending on Twitter purely because of Roblox. But my, my favourite part about the RTC tweeting about this was that Albert replied to them and said, it's not fake, everyone will be hacked. Which I think is fine to say because I'm pretty sure at this point everyone knows that Jenna isn't real. She's not really going to hack everyone. She's not even a real person. Although speaking of Jenna being a real person, I did manage to find a, a Roblox account who apparently belongs to Jenna or who is this Roblox hacker Jenna that everyone is talking about. The account is known as a girl Jennifer and I mean has almost 300,000 followers which I have no idea where all of those followers came from. Maybe they are real, maybe they are botted. I really have no way of telling. But in the creations tab on this Roblox account, the default place that you get when you create an account is literally the only thing on this entire account. It's a girl Jennifer's place and currently it's sitting at 7 million visits. Surprisingly, very, very surprisingly to me especially, I, I noticed that this game was created in 2018 and I've noticed a lot of people questioning whether or not people remember when Jenna was a big and popular topic back in 2018, which is crazy to me because this entire situation that's currently happening right now with all of these rumours coming from Roblox TikTok, this is genuinely the first time that I have ever heard anything regarding Jenna. I also just noticed that this is terrifying, that is probably the creepiest thing about this. On the A Girl Jennifer's place in the thumbnail, I genuinely thought that this was just the Roblox default thumbnail that they place on the default places, but go ahead and take a look behind that tree right there. That is Jenna's avatar standing and peeking out from behind the tree. Speaking of Jenna not being a real person, I found a Twitter account called Jenna the Hacker, who I, I think this person is trying to pose as Jenna trying to say that they are the real Jenna. This video from Roblox TikTok that they posted says, Jenna is back. Hello guys, devil emoji. It's the real Jenna here. A lot of you know me from the online data video. I quitted online dating for a while, but now I am back. I am a returning hacker and I will hack every girls on Roblox. I absolutely love the impeccable grammar that is clearly consistently used throughout this entire paragraph. It's, it's really it's really selling the message, really selling the idea that this person posing as Jenna 
truly is the real Jenna capable of hacking every Roblox player. If you try to steal my boyfriend, I will hack your Roblox account and track your location as well. Might also murder you depending on my mood. That's <laughs> that's not not quite what the rumors are supposed to be. That's that's not what people are posing Jenna as. This is my first ever TikTok account where I will be posting stuff. Do do but believe other fakers. I am better than the other hackers in history. Fear Jenna and then lots of warning emoji symbols. Um, this this is funny. It's nothing more than that. I really hope that nobody was genuinely, truly scared by this because it's nothing more than than laughable. Speaking a little bit more on the place known as a girl Jennifer's place with over seven million visits right now, I found this news article that explains a little bit about the place because I I didn't really want to enter it for myself. So once you open up the game and follow the blood trail path you end up climbing a hill. As soon as you climb up and reach a cave the game shows you a red and black screen that says content deleted and you get kicked from the experience. You will also see 78787878787A on the disc connected window. But don't worry, Jenna or a girl Jennifer's place is not hacking your Roblox account. Yeah, I genuinely have no like true solid understanding about where specifically Jenna came from because all we know right now, the only information that we can find is she was a character in some online data movie that somebody created on YouTube. Other than that, I have absolutely no idea why she was first painted as this big scary Roblox hacker. I have literally zero clue as to why these rumors became so big or why they started in the first place where they came from. But I, I really do like the idea that people are making all of these theories based off of this big scary Roblox hacker Jenna. Like it clearly people aren't being serious with these theories. It's nothing more than a little bit of fun. It's it's really not supposed to be taken seriously. But it's just like I said in the last video I made about Jenna, this is, this is almost nostalgic because just thinking back on what it was like to see the entire community coming together and theorizing over John Doe or just making it such a big event. But of course, it's still very important to remind everyone that this is fake. It's just rumors. You're not going to get hacked and clearly, 7th and 8th of February have already passed. Nothing happened. It's just a rumor. So one more time, please make sure to leave a like on this video and subscribe because I will always appreciate the support that you guys give me. And you know what? It helps me out a lot. But I'm going to the big scary Roblox hacker Jenna being here. She is hacking everyone. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.